Hey, it's Sunday, uh, end of week one. Uh, it is 10 past three, it's quite quiet. I think everyone is leaving on Sundays. Um, yeah, I think departure's pretty busy today. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd do a quick update. I'm feeling pretty lethargic today because it's my day off. Uh, so I forced myself to get up and go for a bit of a walk and do a bit of shopping and that. Um, but yeah, just an update, I am now a advanced scuba diver and I'm beginning my rescue course. Yeah, so hopefully at the end of next week I should be a rescue certified. There's a plane coming in. So I'm just walking down. Um, I'm going to get myself a burger because I've been craving one and I think I feel like treating myself today. Um, and then I'm going to go home and do a bit of studying. Uh, maybe set up my decks and do some mixing, so we'll see. Just on my way back to the apartment. Um, Got myself a burger. I went to the old triangle, which is uh, next to the dive shop, uh, and had a burger with fried egg and bacon. It was really good. I was originally trying to find um, Sammy and Maguire's because I went there last year and did a really good chili burger. But unfortunately, I think his location wasn't too good because he's um, it's closed down. So anyway, the Irish one was good. Um, yeah, so just done some food shopping, had a little walk to walk off the burger, so just heading back now. Uh, I'm going to do some reading of my recovery course. Um, yeah, it's pretty quiet today. Uh, what's happened during the week? Oh, I did some uh, DSDs yesterday, and they uh, one of them did okay. Uh, two of them gave up. They're like, no, nope, can't do this. They wouldn't even go underwater because uh, they turned up. They wanted to do scuba diving, but they're scared of. Uh, and didn't know how to swim, so that was interesting. Uh, what else? Oh yeah. Uh, they've hired a new instructor, so I think I'm meeting him tomorrow. Um, yeah, so all going good. Still feeling pretty lethargic today, but it's quite nice walking around. It's nice and quiet. Um, not too hot today either, which is good. Um, so yeah, back to work tomorrow. Got an early start. Um, I think we're doing some caves. I think cathedral tomorrow. Um, yeah. So I'll speak to you in a bit. All right, I've just got home. Uh, I've got to unpack my food shopping, which is uh, in here. So tonight I've either got uh, carbonara or uh, tuna pasta. I think it's probably going to be carbonara though because I couldn't find sweet corn and that's like the fundamental ingredient for my uh, tuna pasta. <laughs> um, so yeah, tonight I'm just going to chill out a little bit. It's funny, whenever I pick up the camera I always have loads of things in my head that I want to talk about. As soon as I get the camera I'm like, uh. <laughs> um, so yeah, anyway, here is my dive computer. It's kind of cool. It's locked me out for 48 hours uh, and it's just come back online because Mr. Deco stopped and kept diving with it, so I got a bit annoyed. Um, but anyway, it's my logbook. I've just logged my uh, 30th dive yesterday, and that was at the harbour wall. As you can see, I've done harbour wall, blue hole, I've done that a few times, the cathedral, orange coral. So, stacking up the, stacking up the dives. Um, only 10 more till I can start my dive master and I'll have that in probably two days so I've been doing about four dives a day uh, today's the only day I actually haven't done any diving apart from Wednesday because um, my day I'll forget two days off a week um, let's be honest I quite like it when I don't have a day off because it keeps me moving I've actually getting in shape pretty quickly because uh, I'm obviously out in the sun all day and I'm moving stuff around um, whereas <laughs> back in London at my desk all day. I mean, you do a fair amount of moving about and stuff in IT anyway, but there's so many places to eat, like you go get burrito or something, and uh, yeah, you end up piling it all in and then not really doing much to get rid of it. Um, but yeah, so not eating as much as well, that's good. Um, well, most days I actually come home and I'm uh, pretty tired and I've gone to bed quite early. Um, so yeah, no, going well, going well. Um, so yeah, as I was saying tonight, I'm going to do some edit up some of these videos which I haven't edited any of them yet. Um, and yeah, do some studying. Uh, one thing I really miss, <laughs> it's only been a week, uh, but is uh, drum and bass. 
<laughs> as some of you might expect. Um, yeah, I really like missing that because I haven't got any good speakers. I've got like a um, Beats pill, um, but it's just not the same. I need my big speakers from home and my turntables, but making do. <laughs> so that's me done for the day. I've just finished editing uh, the videos for the week. Um, <laughs> it's quite funny watching me on camera because I just have all this stuff on the side and as soon as I get on camera I'm like, um, what was I going to say? I just ramble on about just stuff. <laughs> um, but it's been a good week. Uh, it's been quite nice doing nothing today because I know it's going to get extremely busy soon. Uh, the place where I'm staying is actually really quiet because uh, it's all long term lit so I think probably end of the month or um, Maybe in a couple of weeks it's going to start getting really busy around here. Uh, so I'm just enjoying it for now. Um, so yeah, uh, <laughs> videos are editing, edited even, and I'm going to upload them soon to YouTube. Uh, I think it's, I think my channel's called Dan's Off. I thought that was quite fitting. Um, yeah, so it's about half eight. Um, and I'm pretty excited for next week to do my rescue course. Uh, it's going to be a lot of lifting people and dragging people up the beach and what's, what happens in this scenario and um, I think I think I have to do the fireman's carry, I think that's one lift I have to do and uh, a couple of others. Um, oh yeah, one thing I had to do, which is quite interesting. Um, when, you, when you go down, you can get something called nitrogen narcosis, uh, which kind of affects how you think uh, and it can make you feel sort of drunk underwater. Um, which I haven't had yet, but one of the guys, I think I mentioned earlier in the week, he ran out of air, he actually had that and he was sort of uh, messing around in the water um, and yeah, he ended up running out of air. Um, but anyway, yeah, so part of the advanced, you have to uh, complete a task on the surface and then you have to do a task when you're at 30 metres and see how the time is affected by that. Uh, so I had to do a bowling knot, which I think took me 10 seconds on the surface, and then I had to do another one um, underwater, uh, and it took me just a little bit longer, I think it was 15 seconds. Um, so yeah, you don't really notice it when you're underwater, but actually it does, it does affect you. Uh, so yeah, that's, that's it for the, uh, this week's vlog, I think. I'm just going to chill out now and read a chapter in my book and get an early night for tomorrow. Um, so yeah, see you later.